Hey, how you doing? This is Rob from Pro Arm Gun Reviews, and today we got a really cool gun to show you. This is the Keltec CP33. CP stands for Competition Pistol. Really cool gun. This gun actually holds 33 rounds in a clip, and let's take it to the table, and we'll talk a little bit more about it. So again, uh, today we're uh, doing a review on the Keltec CP33. We want to thank our sponsor. Uh, Preston Spiker from Spiker Custom Gunsmithing right here in Marydale, Delaware and he sent us this gun to do a review on. We really appreciate it. Thank you Preston for sending us this gun. This gun is really really neat. Um, I have other guns that may, are made by kel like the um, the PMR 30 which is a 22 mag. Really nice gun. Um, the really cool features about this gun. Number one, the fact of the matter is that it does hold 33 rounds. They call it a quadruple stack magazine. Really nice setup. Um, you know, we talk a lot about 22s and about how effective 22 caliber is for self-defense. Um, you know, the CP33 falls in that same category. I will say, as far as a carry gun, it's a little bit too big to carry. The gun uh, actually measures 10 inches from front to back. Um, it weighs about one pound, six ounces, a little bit. The PMR30 was like running around one pound one ounce with 30 rounds in it so weight wise it's not that much different but it is a lightweight gun it does have a really cool picatinny rail on top where you can put like a, a red dot or a scope on top a small mini uh, scope on top which is really nice um, it is a blowback design um, inside the gun over here it does not have a feed ramp in there it is a blowback design kind of like uh, some of your high point firearms that also have that same type design um, for the mag release, it's kind of like some of your old military style handguns, which you got the mag release right at the bottom there, uh, uh, drops the mag out. Um, also, a really cool feature, if you are a um, left-handed shooter, it is ambidextrous. It has an ambidextrous safety on the left side and the right side. So if you're a left-handed shooter, it really does not make any difference with this gun. Um, also, this gun has a threaded barrel in the front. So if you wanted to take and put a silencer on here you could you just unscrew this and then screw your silencer right on the end so you could do that that's a cool feature with this gun another uh, nice thing about it it also has fiber optic sights that is like a really good, good feature i think with any gun it makes your targets a lot easier to see your point of aim to see it's got two fiber optic sights in the back one in the front so the you know it like really pops out when you're shooting um, what else? Oh, on this gun, this gun does not like to cycle any ammunition unless it's at least 40 grains. We tried some 36 grain bullets in there with Winchester and it would not cycle. And a lot of that is because it is a blowback design type gun. And we've noticed in even uh, some of the Ruger LCP-22, which we also, uh, um, you know, did a review on, that gun also did not like to cycle 36 grain bullets. It's just not enough to cycle the action back and forth to eject around and put another round in it's just not enough powder charge so if you if you're looking at or thinking about buying a Keltec uh, either a PMR 30 or uh, the CP 33 I recommend at least a 40 grain bullet uh, it'll make it cycle a lot easier uh, also another cool feature with this gun not only that it's it feels like really good in this in your hand you know it's well balanced uh, Keltec did a phenomenal job, and if you're not familiar with Keltec uh, firearms, definitely do some research on it. Uh, they're the only firearms company in the United States that's actually a university, a university that studies on how uh, firearm design. You know, it, it talks about like you know, you know, as far as like you know, the design of the guns. They really study about firearms. It's a really good company. Um, you know, especially if you're even thinking about a shotgun, they got the Keltec KSGs out there that are really good guns they cycle very well so Keltec is a, a company that's been well renowned and well known for a long time so let's go ahead and put some more rounds down range on this on this gun and let's see how it performs
Well, all in all, I'll tell you what I think about the gun. I think the gun shoots very well. Um, it's very accurate. The sights are right on. You know, for home defense, you know, I always tell everyone when it comes to 22 caliber, in this gun, you have 33 rounds to protect yourself. You're substituting the bullet size for a quantity. So if you had a nine millimeter, you had 10 rounds. If someone were to come into your house, you know, you shouldn't be not that accurate not to be able to hit something or, you know, an intruder that comes in with 10 rounds. But, you know, it's always good to know that you have 33 rounds. So, you know, all in all, I think it's a good gun for home defense if this was your only gun to have. Um, you know, there are definitely other choices out there, but I tell anyone, you know, a 22 caliber is definitely a good gun for self-defense. Um, it'll definitely get the job done if needed to in, a, in any type of circumstance. So, all in all, I'm very happy with the gun. We appreciate Preston at Spiker Custom Gunsmithing in Marydale, Delaware. Check him out if you're looking for any type of gunsmith needs. Uh, he's very good at what he does. He's very thorough. Um, got a very good reputation for doing very good work on guns. He also sells firearms as well and ammunition. If you're looking for, you know, a handgun or a rifle, he sells those guns right inside the store. And he's very, very, very people friendly and a uh, really nice guy. And we've known Preston now for a while. He's taking good care of us. We appreciate his sponsor of our channel. So again, this is the Keltec CP33. And we had a great time shooting it today. And you guys be safe.